Welcome to Bank of Baroda's This Is How series. Let's see how you can easily make transactions on Bank of Baroda's Cash Management Portal, DigiNext, from the comfort of your home. Visit www.barodadiginext.com and log in with your user ID, password, and captcha. Now, enter the OTP received on your registered mobile number and click on Submit. Go to Payments tab and hover on Initiate, then Payments. Here you can conduct fund transfers to self, third party, along with any FT or RTGS or IMPS transfers. On selecting any FT or RTGS or IMPS transaction, a window will pop out. Here you must select your preferred debit account followed by selecting a registered beneficiary. Note. If the beneficiary is not registered, click on Ad Hoc and enter the complete account details. Choose the payment type, followed by entering the date of transaction and a reference note if required. Proceed to submit and confirm. That's it! Your transaction has been successfully initiated. Once the maker has initiated the transaction, the checker will receive an alert under the Pending Activities tab. Here, the checker can authorize reject or hold the transaction followed by OTP authentication. In case the release option has been selected, the checker must click on ready for release followed by release or reject. You can easily make bulk transactions as well. Simply click on initiate followed by bulk payments. Select file type as normal file upload and template name as stdpmt underscore xl option. Now select the file from your folder and submit. Congratulations! You have successfully initiated or uploaded bulk payments. For authorization of transactions, we'll have to go to payments followed by pending activities. Click on file upload and select transaction under file verification to accept or reject the transaction initiated by the maker. Once the transaction is initiated by the maker, the checker will receive a notification under Pending Activities on the Payments tab. Here, the checker can authorize or reject the transaction after verifying the transaction details followed by OTP authentication. Again, in case the release option has been chosen, the checker will have to click on Ready for Release followed by release or reject. That's all. You may check the status of your transaction on the Bulk Uploads tab for updates. Stay on top of your banking needs with Bank of Baroda. Subscribe to our channel to view more such videos.